one championship down, one to go. And what a Friday night it was at the Bob Carpenter Center as top seeded Caravelle played number two seed Sanford for the right to call themselves the girls basketball state champions of Delaware. First quarter action was all about sophomore guard Josiah Crawford here off the feed from Taylor Wilkins. She's going to knock down a three-pointer from the top of the key with an early Caravelle lead. And if some is good, you can believe more is better. This time off the Anaya Price feed. Crawford from the left wing. She would hit three three-pointers in the first quarter. And Crawford did some ball handling this time. She finds India Johnston ahead for two points. Caravelle led 19 to 10 after the first quarter. Sanford would make a rally of it. Abby Meredith knocks down two of her 12 points here with the jump shot. And off the steal. Meredith is going to find Zai Kildo. Pulls Sanford within three at 24 to 21. But Johnston comes right back with the three-pointer here. She scored 12 in the first half. Caravelle led 29-23 at intermission. Third quarter action. Zoe Cashman comes up with the steal. Jay Snow finds Meredith wide open for three. Pulls Sanford within one at 31 to 30. But Johnston, a very tough jump shot here. Caravelle led 35 to 32 after third quarter. Fourth quarter action now. Jada Snow with the beautiful pass underneath two Kilgo to tie the game to 37. And Kilgo in the lane gives Sanford a brief lead to 39 to 30. Game tied at 39 now. Skylar Salvo finds Janiah Gale. Gale takes Snow down in the weight room. 41 39 Caravelle. But Kilgo comes right back with another layup tie to game 41. She hit two free throws again. Sanford, a 43-41 lead. Warriors trying to run out the clock, but watch the alertness of Johnston. She bounces the ball off of Zoe Cashner's foot, goes over to Caravelle. She's fouled, going to the bucket, and she is going to make the second. Actually, she made both free throws, of course. The second of two free throws, as you will see. Tied the game with 43 ahead of overtime. First, early in the overtime, Cashner, left wing, drops that. 45-43 Sanford, but Josiah Crawford. One more three-pointer before she fouled out late in the overtime, and this one is for deep. 46 to 45, Caravelle, and they would hold the lead throughout the remainder of the overtime. Here, Johnston off the feed from Wilkins gets the jump shot to bounce in. It's 48 to 45. Sanford's offense can't get going in the overtime, and Johnston seals it at the free throw line. She went five for seven down the stretch. There's one there. And here's another free throw here. And for the first time in school history, the Caravelle girls basketball team is Delaware State champions. They defeat San for 53 to 47. And the celebration is on. Long overdue for a great school and a great program. As you can see, very happy kids. And Coach Caldwell is going to take the DIAA State Championship trophy from Executive Director Donna Pope. And she is going to be mobbed by her players. Very touching scene here. India Johnson is going to hold her piece of the net. 27 points in her high school finale. And Coach Caldwell holds the net. And afterwards, he talked to Coach Josiah Crawford and India about the win. Uh, it's better than I thought it would be. Um, I'm so, so proud of them. And, I mean, look, November to now is a really long time. There's good bad things that are great things that are ugly and this team has really stuck together there's a toughness to this team that i think you saw out here on display tonight they stay together they're tough things happen mistakes made but they're resilient and for them i told them this morning we are not leaving the bob without what we came for and they just had that mentality and i'm proud of them true it was just you gotta get a bucket you gotta score because we want this it's our first one and we, we earned it. We play hard through defense, offense. There was some tough competition though. It shows that we have a big heart for a big family and we just came to win. We came to do this and we came to get this win. Honestly, when we were down, um, I was never nervous. I've always uh, had confidence uh, for my team, with my team. Um, so I just knew that, you know, Josiah, she's a big time player and I knew she was going to make the shot. So I'm just happy for her and, you know, we closed it out. From the Bob, Chris Stevens, first day who support.